Hi guys, how are you? I just wanted to speak to you very, very briefly about death and life. I've had so many people recently contact me and be incredibly distressed about losing loved ones, about the fear of death that they have themselves about the outrage of what's happening in the world at the moment, about the people who are getting the COVID shots and dying from the COVID shots when they've had nobody in their family die from COVID. And, and the irony and the injustice of it all. I've had many people asking me what life is, what death is and how I can be so certain that there's life after life. Like Einstein said, you can't destroy energy, so it must still be there. But I often explain life to people this way. We begin to rise out of the ocean as a small wave, as a little ripple. And then we grow larger and larger. And some of us are lucky enough to become one big, beautiful, perfect wave that cruises and surfs along the surface of the ocean with all the joy of its own being. And then that wave eventually will just begin to curl and begin to turn. And eventually the wave breaks with a rush and a push and it merges again into that ocean of life. But the energy of that wave is not lost. What we see as one individual wave is the part of a string of energy that goes through a medium that will always go backwards and forwards producing more and more waves. That energy is never lost. Water is always moving. It's like dreams. Dreams always exist. We are always in a dream state. Just when we're awake, we focus and we concentrate. Life and our believing that we are one perfect wave or trying to make ourselves one perfect wave is because all of our awareness is focused where we're at right now and not on the bigger picture. If you extend that awareness beyond the bigger picture, you can feel all the other waves. Not only the waves that are rising on the ocean at the same time as you, but you can feel the backflow of all the other waves that have ever been. And you know that nothing is lost and that it all comes together and that we will rise again and that we will break again. Some waves can continue down an ocean shore for a very long time and others rise and expend all their energy very quickly. But they will rise again. That's how I know that reincarnation happens because we see it all around us all the time. Animals prefer to stay with their conscious life that they're living at the moment but they are not as distressed by death as we are because death is a dream where we merge back into that ocean of consciousness and life is the focus where the energy rises above the level to produce a beautiful white horse wave that rises again If you are suffering grief or loss or anger and confusion, just remember this and use your consciousness at the moment to make one perfect way. And here I am waving at you. Wave back. Good night.